The economy magnet kit allows students to investigate magnetic fields, magnetic field strength, what properties a metal has in order to be attracted to a magnet, and the manual includes 16 activities to walk the students through a variety of different experiments. The kit contains two ceramic bar magnets, three ceramic ring magnets, a steel horseshoe magnet, a natural lodestone, a tube of iron filings, four metal plates, and two transparent compasses. The four included pieces of metal are copper, aluminum, zinc, and iron. This is an important aspect of the activity because although they are all metal, when I remove a magnet, only one of them is actually attracted to a magnet, and that is the iron one. In fact, anything that contains cobalt, nickel, or iron will be attracted to a magnet. These other pieces are not. Another activity you can do is to determine the area of influence of a magnet. In this case, I had the steel horseshoe magnet at the 30 centimeter mark and a compass at the 50 centimeter mark. And I made sure that this is not naturally pointing at the compass already. As you move this closer, have the students know when does the compass start to change its orientation. So right around 44, it started to change. So that is the area of influence of this steel horseshoe magnet. The large bag of iron filings is plenty to serve a class of 30, but it is kind of messy, so I would suggest taking just a little bit into a plastic bag, and that way the students can take a magnet, put it on top of the bag, and then they can easily observe the magnetic field around that magnet. Then you can just throw this away, nice and neat and clean. Kids always have fun using magnets, and this kit makes it easy for them to learn and have fun at the same time. Whether it's drawing magnetic field lines, finding the magnetic field strength, or determining the properties that attract a piece of metal to a magnet.